I've been so looking forward to this. It's 744. If you're watching for the One Direction tickets, we are going to get to those in just a few minutes' time. But the other big thing happening this morning was mm. whether or not Riaz Megji was able to hit a home run at the Roberto Alomar Home Run Derby. A lot of pressure here. The West from Inside Performance came on yesterday with a secret, secret weapon. weapon. Uh, we call it Bumblebee, the yellow batch. Uh, James Care Foundation had this home run derby, yeah, like you said, like with Robbie Alomar and friends supporting a great cause. They are coming on at 820 to talk about money uh, raised from the event. Uh, I think the top home run hitter had 21 last year, so 21 was the number to hit. Whoa. Great deal of pressure. And here's what went down at Nat Bailey Stadium yesterday. Here it comes. I got my secret weapon, Lloyd. Uh-oh. What do you think? Uh, the bumblebee. You know, bumblebee. You got the bumblebee going. Now you got to get that load going now. What do you think? What do you think it's going to take? You saw me during practice. What do you think I need to do here? I mean, a little prayer went up. A little prayer? I mean, but, but, but other than that, man, you got them, man. 21? 21. Ah, big it's deal. It. It's all in the head and the bat head. Yeah. Don't forget the bat head. The bat head, the <laughs> yeah, 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 that head. Come on, baby. Now, how many guys do you come across with like an impressive looking physique such as this that, I mean, just chisels? Not many, man. It's not many that I come across with a body like that. It's like a bean pole. It's just straight. <laughs> it's <just> outstanding, man. <laughs> you got it made. I'm serious. Predictions? I predict a couple home runs, man. Yeah? I, I feel it. I just feel it for you. you feel it? It's going to happen. I got to do it for the legend. It's going to happen. Yeah? I'm serious, guys. Bumblebee. You can do this, Bumble. Go get him, kid. Here we go. No, you're all right. All right, here you go. I can't believe those kids are coming in like that. Oh, bro, come on. Come on, get that feeling back. Oh, <laughs> everybody okay? Bumblebee, come on, you can do it, baby. I'm pulling for you. Come on, lift it up. Yeah, it's coming, I told you. I told you, what a coach, what a coach, what a coach. Hey, it ain't me. Thank you. It ain't me, you know me. Go ahead. Woo, did baby. It, baby. <laughs> we did it, man. We did Good it. Good job, baby. See see you work, man. That was great. You saw how pure it was, though? That was pure, too. Pure, pure that speed. was pure. Catch the Jason Robbie Oliver right there. Nice. That is so hard. It is very hard. There might have been some camera tricks involved. No. <laughs> I'm going with the vision, the, the, the surprise, the shock and awe on the faces of the alums. I've never seen alum. such emotion from Robbie Oliver uh, and Homer it Bush. It happened. Something magical happened on the field yesterday, Michelle. Go with the magic of television, Rios. Thanks for believing. Go with it. Michelle, Go thanks for believing. <laughs> it's totally um, happened. Well, yeah. Russ and I were watching it from this side of the studio, and both of us were like, do you think there were some effects there? No. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it was the 120 strikeouts before it that made it a little bit unbelievable. That's what practice is all about. <laughs> it looked good, man. One I, got, I thought it was fantastic. Way to go, Riaz Megji. It is so Goosebumps, goosebumps. Right? Okay. Okay, we had fun earlier showing you the footage from the Home Run Derby. Blue Jays uh, Care Foundation yesterday took place in Nat Bailey Stadium. Two very uh, special guests joining us right now. Richard Saunders, uh, past president of the Hastings uh, Community League, and uh, uh, Rob, the executive director who let me participate in the derby yesterday thank you for that and uh, such an important cause let's break this down for people tuning in uh, a lot of great money was raised for uh, a, a very important local twist tell us about that yeah we raised about $75,000 which uh, will go towards the $150,000 investment into the Hastings Little League and when you talk about the Little League, I mean, we've had some great stories, Richard. Uh, you've seen the progress of the team, uh, not only here in locally in Canada and on the world scale. Uh, this money, that, that's a significant amount of money. Infrastructure, what's going to change and how is that going to benefit programs and, and kids play? Well, we're looking at uh, completely rebuilding our main diamond. Um, we don't really think it's had any refurbishment since 1953. Wow. Um, the, the vertical posts are now so weak that we can't be putting an overhang up in the top of the diamond. But we're also going to build a rookie diamond out by the, um, out by the batting cage. So that'll take roughly 11 teams of rookies and 10 teams of T-ballers and put them on that diamond. So we've got both diamonds split up with our, 
with our numbers now because what we're having to do is we're having to shut down our registration at a certain date because we just don't have the diamond capacity. So this money is going to be huge in going towards the amount of money we need to rebuild both those diamonds completely. You know, really special to hear that, that uh, when we have an event such as this, and uh, Rob, some big names came out yesterday. Robbie Alomar, Homer Bush, Lloyd Mosby, great coach, by the way, batting coach. <laughs> and to see uh, players that have had great success on the national scale come back and give back to the community, really important, really unique. How often does this sort of thing happen, not only here in Vancouver, but all across the country? Yeah, we had a home run derby in uh, Toronto last week, and we've got one coming up in Calgary at the end of the month. So we're going to uh, make sure that we can uh, invest back into some of the flood damage that's happened. And what are some of the thoughts from uh, former Blue Jays players when they come out and they see the future stars that uh, they get to give back, give that advice, and know that this money's being raised? Yeah, these guys love it. They uh, they love the country, and they, they feel so um, associated with Canada and with Toronto. And um, they love traveling and, and teaching little kids how to play. And, and part of it is is the super camps that we run, which anyone can sign up for, but, but a big part is to be able to give back to the community that gave so much to them. Yeah, and how unique is this, Richard, to have programs such as what the Jays Care Foundation is doing to support local initiatives? Oh, it's immensely important, and you know, it's really dear to a lot of our hearts, us baseball fans, uh, because here you have a baseball organization helping out the young baseball organizations, and there's nothing finer than that, and I think, you know, the Jays Care are just uh, spectacular for coming on board and, and, and putting money towards uh, you know a lot of work that we need to do great event and uh, home run derby just for stats how many home runs uh, or do you remember who the, the the top hitter was yesterday yeah I think uh, I think um, his la his last name is Vickers and I think he sh he had about 55 and he stopped because he, he won he was oh, wow. he, you were a close second of course close second <laughs> <laughs> no camera tricks involved with that one hey this is no trick this is just great news all around Tamara producers got the check uh, Rob I'll let you do the Thank presentation you. So on behalf of the Blue Jays and the Jays Care Foundation, we'd like to present Hastings Little League with a check for $150,000. Well, that's absolutely fabulous, and we really, really appreciate it. This is going to be wonderful for thousands and thousands of kids that are going to play baseball at least for the next 30 to 40 years on a beautiful, beautiful diamond. Thank you very much. Massive results. Congrats to you both. Good story to hear. And uh, congrats to Jeff Stock from Vancouver. Uh, we talked about that Brett Lurie signed jersey. We appreciate the support uh, of people that were involved uh, in this whole contest and this whole derby. We had a great time. So good. I wonder, is, is it going to clear up enough this afternoon for you to hit the long ball? If we get rained out, that's okay. You know? No, well, it's not. We can save it until next week, right? No, we can't. Because this secret weapon yeah. that is going to be introduced to you after the break yeah. is on loan and it needs to be flown back immediately after. But what is this thing? Wes Taylor from Inside Performance is here. He helped us with batting practice last week. The Jays Care uh, Home Run Derby goes down today. What could it be? We're going to find out, yeah? Wes has brought the real deal for you. Real deal. Next. 744 back here on Breakfast Television. Okay, so today's a special day because the uh, Jays Care Foundation, the home run derby happening in Nat Bailey Stadium. The money raised going to the uh, Hastings Park uh, baseball field. Wes Taylor here from Inside Performance. Last week we had the chance to do batting practice. Uh, it, it was good to build up the confidence, Jode. And uh, Wes, I thank you for this. But today I'm hearing there's a secret. Well, weapon. you're going up against the likes of Roberto Alomar. Roberto I think you need a little friends. bit of help. Roberto yeah. Alomar and friends and the Homer Bush and the whole, whole bunch crew. of the whole crew are going to be at Nat Bailey. And you are actually swinging for the fences. So Wes, uh, explain the secret weapon and how it, it bring it in here, Dirk. Well, this is the secret weapon. Oh, this is going to get you there. A there we, bat? we don't need the pillow. We don't need uh, the pillow. No, it's not corked. Our friends at Easton, Matt Welsh, oh, um, had this flown in from um, the States. Oh. This is a 2014 model. Yeah. There's not, nobody in Canada has one of these. Nobody so, in Canada so has one of the these. So after the derby, I have, this has to come back, and we have to fly it back to the States. Oh, no, and I'm not kidding. Does it come with its own entourage or just the bat? You're looking at it. That's it. <laughs> what makes this special? It's a 2014 model. It's the latest um, technology in, in composite bats. Yeah. And um, you're the only guy swinging it today. Can, can, so. can I hold this baby? Well, it sure. can it'll I just it'll give you the one? most pop possible. Yeah. So the most important uh, rule of thumb for Riaz to remember when he steps up to, I think you're hitting from second base. We're hitting from second base, but we have the Viz from what we did last week, uh, great tips you gave us. Anyone yeah. doing a home run derby? And Ken. Yeah, yeah. What, what, what is the best advice for this? Sorry, don't worry. Okay. Swing for the fence. Swing. Swing for the fence. Swing for the fence. And remember, you hit one, let one go. Yeah. Right. That's good advice. 
Yeah, don't, don't rush it, right? Because right. it's all about timing, That's you guys right. were saying yeah. last week. It's not and strikes and balls. It's just, here you go. Remember the home run derby at the All-Star game? Yeah. You can take as many pitches, wait for the pitch you want, right? You're right. And as you see Ken working your hips through, that's where your power's coming from. And because you're swinging for the fence, you're going to have to drop that bat over. We're not going to swing like that. OK, the stand. Do yeah. we have the stand today? <laughs> okay, no, that's been retired, yeah. Yeah. Well, we did, it, but, we did make good contact on a couple absolutely. of those pitches. So the secret weapon flown in from? From Easton Factory in the States. But like for you, just for today. Then it has to go back in its special box. And My man, put it here. I'm going to try and do you proud. I'm going to try right. and do BT good proud. Luck. You watching at home. Thank you very You're much. Welcome. All right, inside performance, check this man out. They're very good at what they do. Hey, and speaking of good at what you do, Don, very good at uh, the Heroes Lottery. No. Okay, here we go. Be a the Heroes thing. Lottery uh, getting us ready to win maybe a home, maybe a car, maybe some cash, Don. I'd like to share something with you. Okay. And uh, you at home. Uh, last week before I took off, a uh, very important event happening tomorrow, the Jays uh, Care uh, Home Run Derby uh, competition happening. And uh, they Roberto Alomar. Hello. Bush. Some great athletes going to be there. Somehow, Riaz Megji. Somehow yours truly snuck in there, and we went over to Inside Performance. So, uh, guys, you can roll the vis to, to work on batting practice. This is serious business. Oh, BP is tough. If Roberto is going to be pitching, we need to be hitting it out of the park. So uh, this was uh, all about the technique, the twist, and, uh, yeah, we worked off the tee ball. And i got to say, uh, the boys over there, within an hour, Nelson and I uh, shot this. Learn all of the tricks of the trade. I think we might hit a solid double here tomorrow, Joe. Yeah, a solid double is not going to help you a lot in a home run derby, but I'm proud of you. I'm not going to lie. Look at that. Well done. <laughs> that not, was a dribbler right there. I'm not going to lie. And that could be a base hit. Hey, you know, we got, nice cut. We got some left. After a while, I, back in the day, I was the mathlete, you know, all about the numbers. You were the mascot. And the mascot and the, and the spreadsheets. But uh, by the end, we were making some good contact. So I think tomorrow. Keep it, your head down. If we hit one, it's going to be a good day. Find your groove, Meg G. I think uh, we uh, have to pay for that T-ball because we busted it up pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's cool is that people can get involved with this, yeah. support you yeah. for a $20 donation, maybe end up with a Brett Laurie. Look at you, contemplating the ball. Ooh. Brett Laurie, uh, this. Autographed jersey, so cool. So you go to bluejays.com slash support Riaz, which of course we all do, and uh, proceeds go to the Jays Care Foundation. You can end up with a super cool autographed piece of memorabilia. Great souvenir right there. Kudos to the guys at Inside Performance for hooking up the coaching. Russ, it's going to be a good day tomorrow. It's going to be a great day, buddy. You can always hope for a rain out. You never know. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm hoping in? nobody PBR'd last week's show. Why did I put the over-under at for Meg G home runs? It was five. Yeah, oh. It was five. All right, we'll see. I got your back, buddy. Try to do your problem. How much You're money I put on that? Yeah, but we'll find out. Yeah, it's all going to a good cause anyway. So thanks so much. Uh, looking forward to it, Riaz. It's going to be wonderful.